Hey guys, it's Alina here, and today I've got another first impressions for you. Today's video is on the Too Faced Cat Eyes Palette. So before I get started, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you love first impressions videos and you want me to do more of them, because I would be happy to do that. And feel free to comment below if there's a specific item that you want me to do a first impressions on. So let's go ahead and get started. So the Too Faced Cat Eyes Palette has been out for a little while, but I only recently got it a few weeks ago. So this palette is very similar to their other nine eyeshadow palettes. It's $36. It comes in a little metal tin with a magnetic closure. It's got the same size mirror that's hidden behind the Glamour Guide. And then it has the nine eyeshadow shades, three of them being larger than the other ones because those are going to be the used the most. So like their other nine eyeshadow palettes, there are three different looks that you can create. You have the day look, the classic look, and the fashion look. And of course, all the eyeshadow names are kitty friendly. So this palette is $36 and you can buy it at the Too Faced website, Ulta, Sephora. I didn't find anywhere whether it's limited edition, but like with any palette, eventually it will likely get discontinued to bring in new items. So if you're interested in it after this video, be sure to go get it. I will leave a link down below. I know you guys are just dying to see the colors, so let's get to swatching. All right, so I am all swatched up, so let me get closer and show you all these colors. So here we have all of the nine eyeshadow shades. These were all swatched with no primer and with one swipe of color. So this first set of three here is the day look. The first color right here is called Purr, and it is a beige with a little bit of shimmer to it. The second color here is called Tiger's Eye, and it's this really beautiful shimmery bronze color. The last color here is called Leopard, and it's a dark brown with gold glitter. And this color can be used wet or dry, so it can be used as a liner as well. So once again, this is the first row, which is also the day look. Here we have the second row, which is called the classic look. This first color here is called Meow, and it is a matte beige. The second color here is called Pussycat, and it's this really pretty shimmery lavender color. The third color is called Jungle Love, and it's this really beautiful dark purple with pinkish purple glitter, and this also can be used wet or dry. So once again, this is the second row, which is the classic look. Lastly, we have the fashion look, which is right here, the third row. The first color here is Kitten, which is a light pink color. The second row is a shimmery light blue called Kitty Glitter. And the last color is a matte black called Panther, which can also can be used wet or dry. And once again, this is the last row. And here are all the colors again together. All right, so as much as I hate to say this, because the packaging is so cute and the concept and the theme is so cute. This palette was kind of disappointing. A lot of the colors had very little pigmentation to it. I don't know, it just didn't, it didn't really make a lot of sense to me. The fashion look you would think would have some really bold choices, but these two colors swatched so similarly. So there were three colors that I really, really loved, which were Tiger's Eye, Pussycat, and Jungle Love. But I don't think three eyeshadows are worth paying $36 for. So I'm going to have to say to pass on this palette. It makes me really sad to say that because you guys know I love basically everything Too Faced does. It's very rare for me to say that one of their items is kind of a dud. But I really just, I didn't think that the pigmentation was on point. Or, I mean, it is on point for the colors chosen, but I think that the colors chosen are just... I don't know, it just doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. And when you think cat eyes, you think a bold eye look with a stellar cat eye. And I just don't see bold from these colors. But if you like this palette and you still want to get it, it is $36. I'll leave links down below to where you can purchase it. I'm totally curious what your thoughts are on this palette. Do you have it? Do you own it? Do you love it? Do you hate it? Comment down below because I would love to know. I hope you guys enjoyed this first impressions. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did, and don't forget to subscribe and check out all my other videos. Hope you guys have a good one. See ya.